Hello and welcome to a TL discussion video. Now, I usually do these discussion videos, you know, while playing a video game and because I'm doing the Subnautica series, eh, why not Subnautica? Huh? So, huh? this is TL talking about what's on his mind. But nothing controversial. First things first, I wish I had known earlier that there were jail sacks everywhere. <gasps> Reaper. First of all, beautiful it is just to look for Reaper, although it'll be terrifying if it just looks up at me. And then now I know how dangerous falling them to be, because I'd be instantly in the domain of a Reaper. First things, copites. Are they good or are they bad? And was Louis right? What if Louis was not the awful gluttonous pig we all thought he was? But what if? He was onto something. What if Copites? No. The evil, what if the Copites had nothing but malicious intent? So basically, I've got a question for you. The Plasm Wraith, supposedly indestructible, but there were ways. You know, they, they could have destroyed it. I mean, if they burnt it hard enough, it wouldn't ever return. No, to me, it seems like they might have not wanted to destroy it. But TL! Why would they not want to destroy a monster that kept Captain Olimar as a prisoner. Huh? Well, I mean, riddle me huh? this. When Olimar was yeah. a prisoner, was he huh? suffering? Huh? I, I don't think huh? so. He was just huh? there unconscious. Scans indicate this structure is composed of a metal alloy with unprecedented integrity. No match is found in database. Performing structural analysis. Because what if Louis was onto something? And that there was something malicious and what if he had been kidnapped? Oh, Louis? And all of them. Because haven't you ever found it a bit weird? But why I'm sure there's this whole mission to save their homeland, the Copites. Instead, focus Your best on probability of interfacing with this facility is achieved by accessing the control room in the lower section. Because here's something. Imagine you're running out of food. Imagine huh? 
there's nothing to eat on your planet and you can't eat stuff like oh I don't know um like vegetables you can't eat meat you can't really eat anything but food in fact you just choose not to to go missing and you find it huh? through and fact you know what we're the good guys here we're, we're good huh? 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 and because Scans of that indicate the facilities control room lies beyond well, this doorway you kidnap someone you kidnap them huh? And then you rescue them. Um... The control panel is broadcasting a message. Translation reads. Warning, infected individuals may yeah. not disable I'm just the waiting for this to this stop talking. This planet is under quarantine. Huh? But yeah, what do you do? In the case, Try some sort of planetary emergency and, and you don't want to get new food yourself because that could be a hassle. You kidnap somebody. Huh? Uh -oh. oh no. Oh. You blimmin' hold them hostage inside some weird alien stomach, and then what do you do? Then, what's your ulterior motive? You become the hero, but you become the good guy, and you know what? Since you're so kind rescuing that Hocatatian, or, or whatever they're called, you know what? The Hocatatian government will send some food over. As an olive branch between the two races, you rescue someone that you don't mention, you're the one that kidnapped them. Just, just have a think. Unknown language. Because, Attempting translation. I mean, it's a real no-brainer. The plasma wave would be really expensive to make. I would use up a lot of huh? government huh? funding. Analysis of the patterns Thus, of the walls cannot ascertain whether their purpose is aesthetic or functional. Say, oh, data it's required. Also, a lot of Pikmin 3. Unknown language. Attempted translation. Huh? Yeah, like televised so everyone would see how amazing copites were and how they are the saviors and rescued Captain Oliver. Huh? 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 And Louis probably knew about this, so was sent by the president to like go and save Captain Oliver. Because rumors would start getting out from the Copite government. Um, People would begin saying, oh well, guess what the government's going to do. Yeah. Huh? It would be a really, really good publicity stunt. 
saving a cop I mean a hopitation. And Louis gets sent there. But Louis was smart and he knew that if he did go on with the whole oh I know two guys you actually kidnapped Captain Olimar. A it would be all for nothing since it wouldn't be televised and B it would probably just be like killed there'd be okay you know too much. Bye bye Louis and yeah. That's the end of that. But if Louis just keeps his mouth shut until he could tell his good old chum Captain Olimar later then what to say? He would just oh pretend that he was just hungry and all of that and just just play dumb just so that he doesn't get killed. Because Louis did send out like a broadcast transmission or whatever saying oh my god oh my god please help me please help me I am in danger please help I need your help guys I need your help bro and then Axel surprised when someone does rescue him well, what if that was just a ruse on you know trying to get himself closer to the copites so that he could attempt but ultimately fail to stop them and rescue Captain Onomar from the plasma wave because if the copites died none would be sent back and Onomar would probably just like stay there forever and Louis did not want that so he Basically, he just pretended um, to be in need of assistance when, in all actuality, he was perfectly fine. I'm pretty dying. Uh, and yeah, because it would make sense for something like that to be the case. Because Louis just acting a bit too suspicious. Uh, when the whole sorry, my dog's barking loudly in the distance. With the whole oh my god, I've been kidnapped thing uh, happening. It, it's just it's just hard to believe that he actually thought himself as kidnapped. Because oh no no. Wait, it is not actually showing the bad thing that, oh, oh my god. So it would show up the username which my dad put in, uh, and that's actually related to, uh, what? So if it's just outside noise, basically it's related to, you know, me, but actually, since I can't see it, you guys can't see it either, because uh, I'm not very happy. Uh, so I don't know why I pressed, but price is averted, guys. But I've just got to say, Louis does begin to play <coughs> dumb. Like, oh, I was just... Uh, I, I thought I'd been kidnapped, bro, well, even when I obviously hadn't. But, there's even a more dark reality to what also could be happening. What if the copites already huh? know about what Louis's been up to on the orders of the president what if the copites have already found out because 
Oh look, a purple tablet. They do something that huh? could uh, mean that maybe... Oh no. Die. Now one thing the combats do could allude to the fact that maybe they're in the wrong here. Because they do something that could actually be considered as torture to Louis. Now I'm not talking about him just getting tied up because you know, I mean that is kind of a... Uh, oh man, why do I keep on getting to the screen? That is a reasonable thing to do. Because... Ah. Uh. You know, he, he did steal all of their food and ran off and blew something up. But they leave him just to float in the ship. Now, I'm sorry, correct me if I'm incorrect, but being forced to float in a vacuum, just constantly up and down, isn't that a form of torture? Oh, I'm just going to do something ever so risky. Yes. But, being flo forced to float up and down, up and down, up and down. Wait, I'm also going to... Ah, not, I don't know. That is... Huh? Quite a cruel thing because I was talking to my wi my friend. Uh, and <coughs> basically, um, I said, "Oh, Louis is evil." I was like, oh, they had to like tie him up and leave him floating. Huh? But huh? uh my friend did say huh? wait, but TL, that's a form of like torture, sensory deprivation, like they use it in the military to like I think torture prisoners of war or something. And I was, wait, 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 bro, hold up, just, just, just hold up, so you're saying what the Cockhypes did to, uh, Louis was literally a cruel form of torture. And he was like, yep, it is. Huh? And I was like, whoa. Did Louis really deserve that role? Huh? But what if the Hawkeyes did that to break him just so they knew he wouldn't be anywhere close to a real huh? tooth? Oxygen efficiency decreased. But, yeah, so Louis could either be an absolute psychopath 
Which has just turned him insane. But I mean, Wick could be right and he could. Oh man, Wick. Wick, not Wick. Wick might be a no back his real name. Yeah. Wick's not. I keep on calling him Wick. He's Wick. He's not the kind of person that should care too much. The boss that's good. I, I just called him. Oh. Wick. Wick. With an R. That's like, you know, a joke. Now I would go back to get titanium, but it is so close. So, uh, no, I won't. Although I enjoyed more of the food. But the question of the Moist is Louis generally a bad guy? Or is there something else? Because he's, he's, oh, he's probably does have some mental disorders like. I think the treasure logs are to him having some horses or something like that. But we should be watching my health. And he also probably has an eating disorder that he may or may not have been given that because of the cruelty of his parental figures. If you can really call them parents after. Some would argue that they were nice to him, some would argue that they were absolutely horrible to him. But, yeah. I think I'm just going to go to a place, talk, and watch the sunbeam come. Because I've got a question for you guys. Is Louie a bad, horrible, horrendous person? Or is he misunderstood? No, I'm just going to do some like satisfying watching of the sunbeam and I'm going to turn my mic off for that. Silence for like a minute. Wait, whoa, no, save for people. Wait, no, no, I, I don't. Oh. No, 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 God. If you kill me, I won't be able to see the spectacle of a ship crashing. Honest to God, not even Wick can show me that. Huh? <gasps> oh, it's always creepy when things move. You're like, really far away. <laughs> Survivor, we see you. Yeah! Man, I don't know how you held out down there. We broke an atmosphere, and we're descending towards the landing site. Is that a building down there? What do you mean you can't identify it? Imagine if uh, you just said, oh, I made it. I made Hold it. On. Don't turn it back now. 
Positions everywhere. He's entered atmosphere. Touching down in 10, 9, 8. It's coming from the building? Change course. Set thrusters to full. So did my eye oh yeah, just flash words because it's so loud. I wonder now about about like Pikmin and stuff. I wonder how many species of Pikmin there are on the Pikmin planets. PNF four. Like generally. On like islands for ocean, would there be like multiple types of blue pigmen? Like I think there already like two variations of the blue. Is it like Elvis only? Accidentally, like, press Q, it just 
Aha! Attached. Farming alien plants is a proven survival strategy. And Greek McGill survived 47 months on a healthy, raw salad of live tree roaches and stag root. Yup. They're growing. They're growing all right. Uh, what else would I like to grow? Because now I've got myself a farm set up. I can make a miniature forest. Hey you! Yeah you! I'll put like two. And put the others in the bioreactor. I can back with the bone. Yeah, but I'm charging time. Huh? I think I should upgrade my basic bitch. What can I use? so much you know like in minecraft you can literally 
have now if bundles were thing you could have more but a chest full of shulker boxes of darts that's probably like the amount of darts in a gun
guess I got one sign thing. Okay, TL Talks. I know we talked about the news about them. There's all that dark stuff in the news. Like that Israel thing and it's a bit too bleak to talk about a game channel, so Yeah. But guys, comment below if you made this one what your favourite video game is. I'd actually be really pleased to hear that. I'm going to go to the wall, but like a walker. Oh, not a TL talks, which is not at all trademarked. Seriously, it's not. You can copy it for once. Except for I think like the laws of fair use being or actually no, you can't. But I don't know about fair use. Man, where is Metal Scrub when you need it? I mean, I could just. Oh man, I've used so much battery power. Oh yeah, I can just scan things that I've already used. Yeah, but it's not giving me one. And I've got Metal Savage, but it's going to take it two at a time. Yes! More, that means now I can get like a devil. Good luck. But, hmm, what to talk about? Choose the best survival game. Uh, to be honest, I think Subnautica is the best. Uh, unless you count Minecraft as one. Minecraft is a survival game. Yeah. It's not. It is and it isn't. Like, no. like, it is like, the best survival game of all time, kind of, but also. Uh, some might not consider it as one. I, I've got enough stuff for days. Wall planter. Huh? Wall planter. I like wall planters, as you can see. Yeah, how did how did he tell? Oh, it's the in, indoor group, but I need it. Each I use them quite a lot. And some. Composite plant pots just to fill up the space, and I should be left with one. Ah, oh, uh -uh. I just had one more. Ah, oh, oh well. Well, that's the end of TL Talks for now. Time to record a proper let's play.